if log m base 10 plus log n base 10 equals to log into bracket m plus n plus bracket base 10. We're told that and the value of m is equals to what? 7. Then the value of n is is a no. We want to calculate the value of n. So the first thing you do is write your solution. Okay, we have log m base 10 plus log n base 10 equals to log m log, log m plus n base 10. Okay, now if you remember in log reading that addition change towards multiplication addition we change towards multiplication this is only applicable when the log the base of the log are the same when the base of the log are the same then you can multiply but when the base are not the same you cannot do what you cannot just multiply directly you cannot multiply directly, but the base are the same, so you can multiply. Now, we said, let's see what is common here and common here. It's what? It's this log, log and base 10. Log and base 10. Log and base 10. It's common between both. So what we have to do is pick one to represent both. So we have log base 10 into bracket you know we have picked one to represent this and this we're not left with m and n so what will happen between m and n is being determined by this sign we say that this will change to multiplication so it will be m times what m m times n close the bracket it will be equal to what what is here log m plus n base into base 10. Okay? Now, what is here is also the same thing as what is here. Log base 10 is here. Log base 10 is here. So we can say that, and this is equals, equals to, we can say that this log base 10, we cancel this log base 10. So what are we left with here? We are left with m times n equals to what? What is it? m plus n. So, recall, recall, remember that m is equal to what? 7. So, let's replace m with what? 7. It will give us, that is, it will be 7 times n equals to, we replace this all with 7, 7 plus n okay seven times n will give you seven n equals to seven plus n so what you are you are you have to do is collect you collect the last term this as n this as n you bring this n to this other side so that will be seven n when this n cross this equality sign to be minus n we are not left with what? 7. Okay? So, 7n minus n. 7n minus n will give you what? 6n equals to what? 7. So, what are you to do? Since you are looking for the value of n, you divide both sides by what? By 6. Divide both sides by 6. Here we have n equals to what? 7 over 6. And that is our final answer. Please do wait to subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and share to your loved ones. Thank you.